is the biggest risk. I hope everyone's very aware of this at this point, but the biggest risk is the Federal Reserve's forecast. I mean, uh, Janet Yellen's instability last night, uh, notwithstanding, there's a, a lack of stability in the Fed's forecast big time. So if you stay with our forecast, you're going to get these days where the market gives you plenty of opportunity to buy gold and buy bonds, because on data days, like durable goods uh, yesterday, the 10-year went to 2 spot 0.8%. Uh, on data days, like next week's jobs report, you could easily go back to 2 spot 0.7%. That, by the way, is the new low end of the risk range. I'm getting a lower low in bond yields, and yes, I see that they have bounced. So again, don't focus so much on what things have already done. Focus on what they're about to do. And again, this is what we really have been trying to prepare you for since the 10-year bond yield was at 255 on the 10-year going back to June, July. We kept saying that if we continue to be right on the fundamental data, we will continue to be right on not only the macro call, uh, but how to set up for the macro call across uh, sector styles and exposures. So